Accidents happen. We all have them. But one accident doesn't need to turn your home into a scene from a horror movie. Today, we are going to discuss how to get blood or any other stains out of your carpet. Hi, I'm Jess Machinsky with Big Bob's Flooring Outlet. We will go over two options. One, using store-bought cleaning solution, and two, using a homemade cleaning solution. The first option we are gonna go over is the one we recommend most, a store-bought cleaning solution. Apply a pre-mist spray if the stain is already dry. This will help bring it back to its liquid form and to the surface of the carpet. Just be careful not to oversaturate the area on the carpet. Next, spread the powder over the area of the stain and let it sit for approximately five minutes. The powder will absorb the liquid, bringing it out of the carpet fibers. Finally, vacuum the powder up. By not blotting or rubbing, you are not pushing the stain deeper into the carpet fibers. You may have to repeat the steps in this process a few times to ensure that the stain is out of the carpet but this is the safest way to remove the stain from your carpet for your carpet to last a lifetime. If this is still not working, we have some cleaning tips from the leading manufacturer in the carpet industry, Stain Master. Some general tips first. Do not use hot or warm water. It will make the blood set into the carpet. Only use white cloths to remove the stain. You will be able to see the stain being lifted out of the carpet and no color of the dye in the cloth will be transferred to your carpet is recommended to do a spot test of a hidden area of your carpet before you do it on that area with the stain. The materials used to make carpets vary between different types of carpets and so may react differently than others to these solutions. So do the test to be sure you won't damage or discolor the carpet. Do not rub the stain of the carpet with any other materials. This could push the stain deeper into the carpet fibers and possibly damage the fibers. Solution one. Cold water. If the blood is not dry yet, just use cold water. Blot the area, then fill a spray bottle with the cold water. Spray the stained area before blotting it dry with a dry cloth. Repeat until the stain is gone. Solution two, dish soap and water. If the blood is dried, mix one fourth of a teaspoon of mild liquid dish soap and a cup of warm water. Using a clean white piece of cloth, soak it in the solution before blotting at the stain. For best results, begin blotting from the outside of the stain and work into the center. Blot with a clean white cloth until the stain stops transferring. Let the solution sit for at least five minutes. Rinse the area with cold water until the solution is completely cleaned off. Lay paper towels down over the wet area to soak up any extra moisture. Weigh them down and let them sit overnight. When the carpet is dry, vacuum it in that area to bring back any texture. Solution three. Water and ammonia. If the stain persists, mix two tablespoons of clear, white non-sudsy ammonia with four cups of cold water. Using a clean white piece of cloth, soak it in the solution before blotting at the stain again. For best results, begin blotting of the outside of the stain and move closer into the center. Blot with a clean white cloth until the stain stops transferring. Let the solution sit for at least five minutes. Rinse the area with cold water until the solution is all rinsed off. Lay paper towels over the wet area to soak up any extra moisture. Weigh them down and let them sit overnight. Once the area is dry, vacuum it up to restore any texture of your carpet. Solution four, hire a professional, but you will get caught with your murder. If the stain still persists after all these options, you will need to contact a professional to help restore your carpet. Hopefully this video helps you clean up all those stubborn stains and gets you in the spooky mood of Halloween. Don't forget to leave a like and a comment of what solutions work best for you. And while you're here, subscribe to our channel for more content like this. We post a new video every week.